Happy, happy, happy Saturday, uh, January 25th. Um, checking the temperature outside. It's uh, really cold. Um, but I thought it'd be a good shop day to come in and uh, finish finish up some items, or at least make some progress on some items. So I'm going to fill the the gaps on the the um, kitchen island that I'm making, and uh, uh, start grinding that in preparation for a clear coat, nice satin finish. So I'll, I'll show you what I'm going to do here in just a second. Map gas. I use a torch on this, but this is easier to bring over here. What I'm going to do is just fill fill this in a little bit and put kind of a nice little crown in there. If you look at the the um, I did pretty good. It's less than a sixteenth of an inch. Um, the corners, you'll notice here where this is flat, I welded that upside down. And then the corners here, there's a trick. If you want a 45 degree angle, cut 43 or 42 and then use a jig to make the right angle. And so, and then also these were ground so that they wouldn't, they, these were ground up and in. Um, let the jig make the right angle. You cannot cut a right angle uh, when you when if that's what you want to make so let's put some uh, let's fill that in a little bit and then take another shot okay, you can see how the I filled in the uh, the cracks there and so now what I'm doing is a combination of filling in and then grinding down just using an air grinder but I'm gonna take these pockets out and make smooth transitions on the corners and then when I'm when I'm ready, then I'll use a flat sander instead of a grinder because I won't be able to get them straight. Uh, so let's start doing these now. I'm also doing these welds in gravity, which will help out a lot. So I'll show you the next step. Can you see how the joints are nice and smoothed out? You got those smooth. I think they'll be alright. Filled in. And so I'm going to hit it with the vertical sander now. Wow. The, uh, so this is the corners are blended. Kind of even those out now. Nice and shiny. Use a rotary tool, 120 grit. Um, haven't done that real yet, but I'll, I'll finish the, this side. I'll do the other side. Then I'm going to go over with a nylon uh, brush, uh, kind of like a 3M tool, but for rotary, and uh, do a nice satin finish, and then clear coat it. So, getting there. 